Great question we got is how can we incentivize our customers to become brand ambassadors for our property? That's a great question. I'm going to lay out some things that we've used and done with UR Comp to great effect to build our social media following. And I'm going to order the answers from like lowest effort, easiest to um, most engaging and, and most of a commitment from the property. So first would be responding to posts. Respond to them individually as often as possible as a reply to the comments. You make a post and people are like, oh, awesome, whatever. <laughs> like, oh, I love that. I love uh, the new restaurant. Respond to each one individually. Hey, thanks, Joel. This is great. Um, that would be the first one. Again, it's more effort than a like, but actually responding makes that customer feel like, whoa, you know, like I, they feel a deeper connection when you reply. Next would be sur put out surveys, and then when the people reply to the survey and give an answer, thank them for that, but then also act on the surveys. Then the people that uh, suggested something, if you ultimately went that route, uh, they're gonna feel more of a connection because they feel like they are invested in your property. So that would be another one. Next is one that I think a lot of casinos already do a pretty good job of, but is it's just swag, wearable things that, that the people can wear <laughs> because then you know if they're wearing your brand, they're gonna feel more connected to it. Just subliminally, subliminally, uh, they're just gonna feel more connected if they're wearing your logo. All right, now getting into the advanced levels. I think you should feature different employees and not just a picture of them, like, hey, here's, here's Tony, he's worked in the kitchen for 10 years. Um, I think actually like getting them talking, like that way your, your customers will see them, see the interview. I mean, it could be like a one minute, like, hey, how long have you worked here? What's your favorite part about here? What do you love about our customers? Kind of a quick questionnaire like that. Post the video on your social media channels. Then the customers, when they come in, they see Tony, like, oh man, Tony, I saw you on social media. They're gonna feel more connected. It's not just the logo when they drive up. They're, now they're gonna see different individual employees that they're gonna feel connection with. They're just gonna be more entrenched in your brand. Uh, and then lastly, I would say going live through a social media channel, whether it's a Facebook Live, a YouTube, uh, Instagram, and then engaging with people that way. Uh, there's obviously some risks there where you're, you'll get comments that are like, hey, you know, uh, the machines are too tight. Why do you tighten the machines? That's gonna happen. But I think you can address it in a fun way when you start like, hey guys, we just wanna say hello, answer questions you have. I get it, you know, the machines maybe, you know, like we're not gonna address the machines being tight or not because honestly, we don't control that. Like whatever, come up with a fun way to address it at the beginning so then you can ignore them as they go on. And eventually the people will stop asking those questions if you, um, address it up front. But going live is a great way to get people to feel connected because you're answering them. They can see your face as you're answering them. Um, so that would be another great way to make people feel connected to you. And then they're going to go uh, be ambassadors and spread the word about your property to their friends.